In the blistering cold, they waited, sleeping in tents, food coming down to granola bars and energy drink, their only warmth coming from a lone space heater. But these young men and women will all tell you it was worth it. Why? Because they now have the PlayStation 3, Sony's much anticipated gaming console. Most stores in West Michigan had only a few come in this first shipment, leaving those coveting a PS3 to some drastic measures. We've been here since last about night, about 9 p.m. Now, were you the only six that showed up, or did they have a process? We of actually like... had a total of about 25 people that went down, and then this morning they came out and said they're only going to have six, so they all left. At Best Buy in Granville, a riot ensued and police had to be called in. There's a lot of yelling, a lot of shouting, you know, who was here first, who's in line, who should get the, you know, the first 26 that are released, who shouldn't. We got lucky, it didn't come to violence. That was crazy. In the end, it was 26 lucky people who were given the opportunity to wait outside for two days in order to acquire a PlayStation 3. At Circuit City, only six consoles came in, so only a select few had to camp out. Of the 32 people at both locations, only three said they were planning on playing their newly acquired machinery. The rest were going to sell them on eBay, where units have been going for up to $3,000. It's an investment that we get together on every week. <laughs> There's some risk, but I mean, the payoff's so huge. If we don't sell it, we've got, a, we've got a PS3, we'll just keep it. Combine the rarity of the PS3 with its high-end graphics and Blu-ray technology, and it is understandable the frenzy this little black box has caused. Sony will ship more PS3 soon, and while we don't know exactly when, we can be sure they will be plentiful for the holiday season. Yet, for these 32 people, all it took was braving the cold weather, and the result was that Christmas came a little early.